Hi ladies, good to see you again. Good to see you too. Uh, how have you been? Yeah, good. good. Working on our uh, spring collection. Okay, okay. So it's been, I guess, a few weeks now since we last caught up in my office. Yeah. We sort of had some slightly difficult conversations <laughs> last time. You've had some time now to probably digest everything I spoke about. What have you come up with after we met in terms of thinking about um, ways to improve cash flow for the business? Well, we're thinking of uh, trying out a capsule collection of things that okay. are more uh, something like this. Beautiful. That's still funky, mm -hmm. that's still got our, yep. our signature edge. <laughs> yeah. So to say, and classy, and it doesn't take as long and it will be cheaper than um, say a couture piece. Okay, yeah. awesome. So what other things are in the collection? Oh, and we were also thinking of um, Children. children's clothing. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> yeah. So we've got a few um, sets. Oh, that's so cute. And that's a little tie up with a yep. little tulle skirt and we've got that in pink and blue. I've got a four year old, Annalise. She would love this. <laughs> What sort of price point are you, you you're looking at oh, for these? The, the sets would be around like 250, I think we were thinking. Okay. And they're like light cottons and things that um, are not as, it doesn't take as long to make, but it's still like the good quality. And where will you be selling this the, this collection? We're yeah. going to do it on our website uh, and a few marketplaces and see yeah. how we go. How will you market this? I think we'll try maybe Instagram shopping and maybe do like reels and stuff and because that will be the younger. You will see. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's really good. I am so glad to hear and I'm really thrilled to hear that you've um, taken on board, you know, what we spoke about in our last couple of meetings. So <laughs> Thank you. So ladies, we've spent quite a bit of time together and you know, you've been very generous to let me into your business and you know, analyse what's been going on for you. I mean, I just have to ask, what's the number one thing that you know, you, you, you've learnt over this period um, and, and how are you going to apply that now to your business going forward? I think we learn a lot yeah. and the now we more um, calculate numbers yeah, we'll, we'll <laughs> and be more thinking, be more like uh, organised and less procrastinate and working more harder. We, we, yeah, we won't just do what we love, we'll do the hard stuff too. <laughs> yeah, OK. Yeah. I think we're just going to um, write everything down and maybe not in a spreadsheet how you would, but just so we know what, how much time we spend and have a bit of like an outline of what we're, what okay. we're doing. It's not even about working harder, I suppose. It's about working smarter. Yeah. And, you know, the time and effort you put in, it's, you know, you can continue to do that. I'm not saying not to do that. But if you want to transform this from a hobby into a true business, you've got to look at the numbers. And I think when we first met as well, you, you sort of told me your vision for MTTC. Um, is that still the same? Yes, yes. yes. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, we'd still like to have our own boutique. Good. We've had some invitations for our spring to show our spring collections um, in some events overseas. And have you thought about cash flow and how that will continue? We'll try the Instagram um, marketing with the capsule collection and see how that goes. I think that was sort of the missing piece. You, you didn't really have a huge amount of marketing previously. Um, and so, yeah, that, that's great. I look forward to seeing it.